Okay, so put the box on there. You got the box on it and just unscrew the zinc, pencil zinc out of the top of the engine. Yep. There's another one on the other end yep, at the, the other end too. at the back, okay, or at the bottom. I'll put the box back on it so we don't round off the corners. And that's a ratcheted wrench, so you can... Oh, that's what happened to the wrench slip. Okay. So the wrench is on back. No, just flip it over. Oh. Flip it over. It's two-sided. Is this right? The right one? No. No, no oh. flip, flip it over. Oh, my gosh. It's a ratchet. <laughs> that's a good wrench. Okay, I see it moving. Is it moving? As soon as you hear it squeak or break loose, then you can yeah. flip it and put the open end on it. I'm curious to see if... Like that. It's coming out? Yeah. I just don't want to lose that brass washer. Well, guess what? It's yeah. gone. <laughs> Let's see. Let me see. Put it in my hand. So the actual zinc itself is chewed up. You can see where it broke off right there. So we can still do our training today, but we'll want to have this checked. And we'll look inside here in that hole. Let me stick my finger in the hole. Okay. So if the other piece fell in, it fell to the bottom. So we'll be good to go. I but we'll, we'll Let's want put to. put a new one in. Okay, you got a new one. Let's go ahead and put it in. And then you talked about this washer that right here. Bag right there. So we'll have to change the washer. Just yeah. can't this the whole bag. No, just, just right there. I think that's got all the pencil zinc in right there. Now, something I'm not comfortable with. Let's cover up that oil yes. fill so we don't want the zinc or anything falling inside that hole. Of course, we'll have to take that off to put the black safety cover back in <laughs> place. Okay. I wondered about these. I have changed all the sinks, and then when we, I just had the boat hauled uh, okay. this month and done the, did the bottom, and um, my rectangle zinks on the stern were still. Okay. 80%. Put it next to my hand. Flip it over. There you go. So I was thinking that the zinc fell into the heat exchanger, but what I'm seeing right now is the brand new zinc is about the same size, the same length as the old zinc. And you don't necessarily have to buy these zincs from the engine brand manufacturer. No, don't. <laughs> you can okay. buy them. Uh, right here, boat zincs. Okay, uh, boatzincs.com, that's what you've got. Yep. Or you can buy them from the boat store and hacksaw them in half. Okay, let's go ahead and put the good one in the hole. Okay. We should change the other one, shouldn't we? Well, if we do that, we're going to dump a gallon of water into the boat, so we can do that tomorrow. So that whole heat exchanger is full of salt water, and we'll dump it into the boat. So that, we don't need to do that today. We'll do that tomorrow. And just feel which way it turns. Okay, flip the wrench over. I'm sorry, you had it right the way. The first time, pardon me. I thought I did, Chris. Okay. Just one umph. Oh, that's it. That's all you need. Nope, that's it. No more. No more, no more. Okay. Okay, so we just changed the zinc. And then we'll check, check the oil right here. And we will take this off to put that big plastic cover back in place and then put that back together again. Easiest part.